hey saints hope you're having a blessed sunday so far i pray the most High continues to bless you guide you protect and provide for you and your beautiful families in both your going out and coming in amen if you see my face for the first time i'm sister anastasia grace welcome to the channel please go ahead and subscribe if you feel like this is content that would serve you welcome again grace fam happy to have you um i actually planned to do a different video today but the holy spirit led me to talk to somebody today i don't know if this video is for you but stick around and listen because lord knows you need to hear this okay so let's talk about monitoring spirits a lot of us have people in our lives that are not genuine that are not really for us that are only in our lives to monitor our progression even our regression stuff that are happening bad in our lives it doesn't matter they just want to be monitoring you because they want you to be in a position of lack be in a position of sadness they really do not want you to have a happy life to be successful right how you know people like this in your life look they are the first to come around when something bad happens to you when somebody died when your car was totaled when anything whatever it is happened to you that is bad they're there for you they call you but when something good has happened for you they're nowhere to be seen or they send you one congratulations dry even if they send you an exclamation trust me that is not the real excitement or there is no excitement on their end when good things are happening in your life they are missing in action or they give you the bare minimum all right so you have to be careful when you go around people when you see somebody and the first thing they say how are you doing you have to be careful the information that you give someone i will tell you the best response to that god is good even if you're having the worst possible day the worst possible week month or year god is good that answer can never ever ever be misinterpreted can never be seen as you because god is good so you give them an open field no specifics because you have genuine people but you don't know who is really genuine from those that are really not genuine a lot of people are mixing themselves up in some sorcery and on the outside they look like a little lamb like an angel just dropped from the sky so you cannot just have your business out there that is why in this technology time with social media and everything where everyone is over sharing and then they wonder how did this not work out why did this not come to fruition because you over share you posted something about it either on your whatsapp status on your instagram your facebook and so on and then those monitoring spirits people with bad intention grab onto that and they do what they do you have to stay prayerful and that is why it's good to grow in silence growing in silence can never be a bad thing when you get to your finish line when you get through with what you get through if you want to share you can share but the best way to go about this is to make people see the results make people see the goodness of god in your life you don't need to overshare be a light be that example let your light shine among men that they may see the good work of your father which is in heaven when the bible says that your light shine what is light light doesn't come with noise hallelujah light does not come with noise but when it enters a room you see it right when it's in your presence you see it okay so let your light shine build in 
silent and stop over sharing my sister my brother i don't know who this video is for but please please try practice sometimes you may be excited about something and you tell your friends and i'm telling you a lot of the times those same friends are the ones that behind closed doors are plotting against your progress plotting against your happiness plotting right against the goodness of god what god has planned in your life amen so please saints please try 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 to remain humble remain focused and put god first a lot of the times we make certain things idols in our lives and God needs to be first in our lives. He said if we put him first, all other things will come after. All other things, everything you ever desired once it's according to his will. Amen. Example, you can't desire somebody's husband. That's going against the will of God, going against the word of God. You have to be practical here and you have to stay in the word. But once you put God first, you will see all the things that you thought you had to run down just come towards you. Those doors will just open for you. And you're like, all these years I've been, I've been wanting this. And then it happens. Why? Because you put God first. You stayed focused. You kept your, kept your mouth. Just like when the angel of the Lord had to close his mouth so this baby could be born a lot of you are pregnant but why what is hindering that baby to be born in the spirit is because you have either a circle around you or you yourself you need to keep your mouth keep your mouth and just let the works of the Lord happen in your life let them see let them see let that birthing process that labor that 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 birthing labor that entire process happen and when that child comes they will see amen amen so i don't know who this word is for i don't know who has an idea a business who wants to go get a visa who wants to start something or a class start a course start doing some research online trying to do different things i don't know what you have planned for the end of this year going into next year but the holy spirit is saying keep it in here keep it within in your belly in your mind and just focus pray standing up to the heavenly father pray and just work in silence because greater is he that is within us amen and even if we cry in the night joy comes in the morning amen so just keep your faith in these times it may be rough it's a rough for a lot it's rough for a lot of people but guess what once we have christ in the vessel we can smile at the storm all right so i hope this video blessed you i don't know who this video was for but the holy spirit said eh do this somebody needs to hear it maybe you're about to talk or say something to people and those are the same people that we're gonna try and stop remember when daniel prayed and he fasted and his answer was actually coming right remember it was that angel a uh, 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 angel of satan that was there fighting fighting the angel that was coming with his answer hello listen i'm telling you that the spiritual realm is a real thing and a lot of people are working for the next side and they put on the face like they're on our side amen so you have to be very careful pray for the spirit of discernment and just pray for god's continual covering and continual protection in your life for you and your family just go ahead and do it pray about it holy spirit is saying go ahead i don't know what you plan to do but go ahead but do it in silence 
amen and put god first amen amen so i love you all so much i didn't even realize that the dogs are barking anyways i love you all so much the lord loves you jesus is lord and i'll see and talk to you all very very soon bye